Why do you need to be that handsome? <laughs> it flutters <Stop>. my heart. <laughs> it flutters <laughs> my heart. I love that. That is beautiful. Who said that? Answer. Oh. <laughs> Who said that? Who said that? Um, I'd, I'd, she looks quite young. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Let's just end that there. Let's let's um, um, let's nip that in the bud before. <laughs> Hey guys and welcome to the Celebrity Expert, your number one source for all things TV shows and celebrities. And in today's video, we're going to look at Asa Butterfield and Emma being obsessed with each other. Sabrina, she's just cool. She can like cast spells. Yeah. Know. That would be cool. I, I mean, I'm, I, yeah, I'm use, I, we're cream. using her as just like for her magic, not actually her. She's magic, so, you know, that's cool. Both James and Alyssa are sort of terrifying. <laughs> she's badass. She's, she's cool. Uh, she's she got great uh, one-liners. You're pretty <laughs> <laughs> Before we begin with this video, here's a quick and easy question for you all. Can you all tell us how old Emma and Asa are? If you know the right answer, let us know in the comment section down below or stick to the end of the video, which is when I'm going to reveal the answer to this question. I'd like to put an unexpected item in your baggage area. No. <laughs> oh my! Hey, I'm Mr. Wright. Someone said you were looking for me. Oh dear. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. Minus 2500. <sighs> In addition to learning everything there is to know about sexual health, the thing that makes watching sex education so special is the beautiful relationships that form both on screen and off screen. Oh. But also. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I, I can't imagine mind. you, but yeah. Oh, no, I'm a, I'm a, I can be, but it's definitely. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no, that's happened. Oh. Certainly. Okay. Right. It happens. It does happen. It happens. Yeah. Seeing our ships sail in the series has been so rewarding. But of course, there are a few couples that we would love to perhaps see together in real life. At the top of that ever-growing list is none other than Emma and Asa. Yeah. Oh, they done something to my eyes, which is really weird in that photo. Yeah, they did something to Yeah, they made my eyes like lasers. <laughs> No, they honestly have. There's no shadow inside them at all. Oh yeah, my camera's. It's because you're clear, there. pure and clear. But they are pretty, like. I know. Amazing. They're in blue, life. but they're not yeah. that. They're not like. They're not that. Blue. That looks like they give off the light. They look like this. Yeah. 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 Emma and Asa's respective characters on the Netflix original series have always had some sort of special connection. However, this may be due to the fact that these skilled individuals have tons of chemistry off screen. In the time it takes this dog to steal a sausage, name five. Things beginning with P, well, potatoes, pants, Paris, paparazzi, and poo. <laughs> 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 that I can't believe I just said that, sir. It was that the perfect timing. Just, it was, that's why it made me laugh, because the dog went that as I said it. Are the two actually in a relationship or are their acting talents just so good? We tell you that the dating stages of these sex education stars in this video. It turns out that these actors' skills are just that extraordinary because their relationship is simply platonic in real life and the two have actually never dated in the past. However, their connection is certainly not disingenuous because Emma and Asa are pretty good friends in real life along with the rest of the cast of the sex education. Oh. Oh, you got this. No, ooh, don't bite too hard. <laughs> really go for that. Is it like it's, it's, it's like um like one of those like Good you know the things and they've got like those balls of plastic that just like pop out. When will you use them? When you're stressed. Uh -huh. Stress balls. Uh -huh. yeah. Additionally, it would beside us to not mention that Emma was in somewhat of a committed relationship after meeting Butterfield on the set of the Netflix original series. It's been reported that she had a fling with Dan since 2020, and though the coupling was of low profile, the two are allegedly rather serious, meaning a relationship with the Netflix co-star was otherwise impossible. Hey guys, Nick. Hi, Nick. The boys are about to eat some crawfish. We are. We're about, we're, we're about to eat some crawfish. Yeah. Yeah. No, 
And speaking of Asa, it seems that he's another more private individual when it comes to his dating life. But from the looks of his Instagram, it doesn't seem that he's currently dating anyone either. Perhaps the two till get together in the middle of their singleness. Perhaps they won't. We'll have to wait for that and announce when it is actually official. Strike your best oh. supermodel pose. Okay, well, come, come on. on. Oh, no. Oh, see those eyes! Look at them! Come on, the boy! That's me. I'm done. <laughs> He's done. Out. Their biggest celebrity crush. Oh. I've. I'm I don't know if you'll get mine. I've never asked kids. No. I don't think. <laughs> we I, don't really have. I don't think we have. We. You know. No. no. It's quite we a weird have thing to sort of talk street, about. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. We're like, well, hello. You, I was going to say, you know Matt. <laughs> Who do I rap to you like every two seconds? Oh, okay, yeah. As we wash our tears away over the fact that Emma never got to hear Asa's proclamation of love for her because of her new buddy Isaac, we find solace in the pair's off-screen bond as best friends. In the meantime, be sure to watch Asa and Emma's characters figure out their weird relationship in the upcoming season of Sex Education, which is going to premiere soon on Netflix. Bold. You're, I don't know. You're, I would say you're I impulsive. Might be creative or impulsive. You're, I don't you're think, impulsive? am I impulsive? I feel Sometimes like you are. You're an Aries. You're also very smart. Oh, this is very hard. I mean, this is question one. And we're I know. like, <laughs> who am I really? <laughs> How would you describe me? <laughs> who um, am I? Honest? Emma, say smart. Honest? Are you honest? I could be honest. Are you being lying to me? The star's journey as besties began when they filmed season one of Sex Education with Emma, who was 24, starring as Meeve, who helps organize Asa's character Otis' appointments with his fellow students for his secret sex clinic. Oh, it's a nice noise. noise. Pineapple on pizza is, isn't that bad. I just, I just don't really care. I don't see why this is such an issue. Mm. People eat so many weird things. Pineapple is a fruit. People have sweet and sour, whatever. It's not that big of a deal. Like, the world is on fire. Also, pineapple is good for your... health. <laughs> I'm around, I'm around. <laughs> Last year, Essa and Emma embarked on their road trip across the US and the trio looked closer than ever. Since then, fans often share clips from their visit on social media to show just how good they are friends in real life. Go on, Essa. Who, who is the most likely to be on hand in a crisis? Oh. oh. Um, okay. Let me think about it. I need to think about it. I know. <laughs> okay. Three, one, two, two one. one, Emma. Emma. It's clear that these two have become very close friends alongside their co-stars and the next season of Sex Education is coming soon and we cannot wait to see more off-screen content from these lovable stars. Ah! Ah! Can you take me to the doctor? I just broke my leg falling for you. He gets yeah, 50 he's, he's points for the commitment. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, most likely to steal a street sign. I know. Three, two, two one, one, eight, star. Star. <laughs> <laughs> This is too easy. This, this is, is too easy. easy. Yeah, yeah. I just have feel like you before. No, he has. No, he definitely has. I can't see you doing that before. Yeah. Yeah. I, no, it wasn't a street have. sign. I mean, it's what like a, was it? That's just a cool sign. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted it. <laughs> As Netflix binge watchers gear up for Sex Education Season 3, we are left with sadness over the conclusion of the previous season, which might have been so different if the scriptwriter had chosen the alternate ending. I've Uh, Is it true? I used to when I was younger, but not anymore. Well, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. I mean... Let's just... Asa. Well, I don't, Asa, I, don't, I, think I, don't know. I don't know. Yeah. And your mum's a therapist as well. Like, I can imagine. I do. Oh, no, yeah. I do. I yeah. talk with my mum. Yeah. Really good. Off screen, it's evident that all of the key characters are good friends. The actors who play Amy and Adam are in a relationship, but Asa and Emma exchanges are usually fan favourites. Alright guys, so now is the time to reveal the answer to the question I asked you at the beginning of the video. And so the answer is Essa is 27 years old and Emma is 26 years old. If you got this answer right, then you're a huge fan of the series Sex Education. Get, I'm like, yeah it's, yeah. yeah, it's like, it's so, it's so lovely for us and for people to, to kind of see us be friends in real life because yeah. it's like, mm -hmm. it just, it just means that anything you see on camera or any like fun interaction or improvisation is, is real it's and real. it's like yeah. us having fun, which I think is nice for people to see because there's loads of 
darkness and toil and travel going on in the world. All right, guys. So we'll see you around next time with another brand new video. Till then, keep watching the celebrity expert. Bye, guys. Bye.